from the car. Hey, Frankie. Hello. We're outside of Harbor Freight. Yeah, we decided to go stop by. Well, it's been, how long has it been since we, we've been into this store? It's been a while, like four or five years. At least, yeah. Yeah, yeah we did a video from this store mm -hmm. years ago. And... I would think that their stuff might change, but yeah. who knows? Harbor Freight is tools mostly. Just think tools and garage Cheap tools. gear cheaper. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. And they usually have something for knives. Yeah, there's usually like one or two to choose from. It's usually pretty pathetic, but honestly. Don't think Spider Co. and Benchmade mm -mm. and Kershaw. It's, no. It's their own brand or maybe, I don't know, like what are Gerber or something like that? Maybe something like that. I don't even think they have that stuff, but I, I forget. I mean, it yeah. has been four years, so who knows? You can leave here with a pocket knife. I know that much, but yeah. Interesting. Prices, materials, that'll be interesting to check out. But are we going to leave with a pocket knife? No. <laughs> We're going to leave with 20. 20? It's the Christmas season and we have to, we have to think gift gifts. people. Yeah. That's All true. right, now let's get in there. Okay. That's where we ought to go next. Maybe. 511. We'll 511. Yeah. Anyway, we're driving past this place. We gotta we gotta check it out. Mm -hmm. Weren't you saying somebody just left a comment? Yeah, there's supposed to be some sort of different knife in here than that other like what would you, what did we call it? The boat anchor? Uh, yeah, we had yeah, the boat right, anchor yeah. from Harbor Freight. Okay. Yeah, and it was like a two ninety nine something or other. Yeah. No knives yet, but we did find flashlights. Yeah, here's their flashlights. Brawn. Nice. We actually have some of these. Yeah, we do. You get those free pretty regularly too. Free? Yeah. Yeah. $2.99 for two of them. I feel like the prices are kind of expensive. Am I just thinking that or um actually yeah. Yeah. I would have thought this this I don't know. Why is this brand so expensive? Yeah, twenty-four dollars. 50 for 7,000 lumens? Don't we have that in just our keychain lights? I don't know. It seems like Olight's got it beat. Where's the knives? I think in the middle. Let's in the middle. This. I always love these moving blankets. We could even use another one of these. We've got one in the back of the car right now. Yeah, I guess we do have it right now. Look, they have bigger ones now. These are huge. I don't know. This isn't the knife video, though. This is knife content. We use it on the table. Oh, you found it. Yes, I did. Hopefully more than this? No, this is probably it. Yeah. Ooh, look at that one there. There's all kinds of bright colors. What do you got? Um, okay, there's a couple of folding knives. Is this the only brand, Gordon? I think it's a new brand, it must be. Didn't it used to, what was it used to be? I it's don't like remember. Garden something? Yeah. Oh, no. I thought it always said Garden, but it's Gordon. <laughs> Wasn't it Garden and now it's Gordon? That's what you said? Yeah, yeah. that's, yeah. Yeah, that's what right. I said. No, what is this? There's a tactical one for $14.95. $14.99. inch blade. These seem overpriced. 7CR17 MLV. That's not going to have what you call edge retention. It's $25. $25? That's crazy. This is $10. This one says it folds easily. It's always a good selling point. actually have a hawk bill. Uh-huh. It's, it's a, a folder. It's a button lock folder. Yeah, it is. Hawk bill. Can't even find that at uh -uh. Blade HQ. No. $14.95. What and is the steel on that? Stainless. Stainless, yeah. Uh -huh. Yeah. Yeah, and what's this one up here? $7.99. 
Yeah. I could help her with that. I'm a little taller. Yeah. Third, sorry, it's 3CR13. Is that talking about... Okay. Is that That's the carbon nice. content? Or is that That's something about good. the carbon content? The 3? Because the CR is the 13. That's chromium. So I'm thinking that's... Uh, that's crazy. It's got the edge retention of tinfoil. <laughs> that's crazy. And is it $7.99? That seems really expensive for it, too. There's so many know. better knives out there for this. Better price. It seems like Walmart has got this place beat, huh? Yeah. You'd do. think it'd be the other way around. Well, their machetes I, at least are affordable. This is what you'd picture for Walmart to have. Yeah. Like their own cheap brand and hardly any selection. Uh-huh. A machete is six ninety nine though. Seems not bad. I guess Walmart does have their own cheap brand, but they often have a much better selection. Okay. We have something like that. Yeah, these are all button locks though, which is crazy. No, we do have something like this yeah. though, don't we? Uh -huh. It's nicer quality. Oh yeah, for sure. We did a video on it a couple months uh -huh. ago. But I think it's crazy that these are all button locks now. Yeah. But look, you can get it in that bright color. There's red, there's like a different blue. It's interesting. Huh. What else is there down here? I believe we have one or two of these Pittsburgh brand tape measures at home. Yeah, you get them free, so you get them all the time. You get them free? What are you mm -hmm. talking about? Yeah, you can use a coupon. Oh, yeah. we have in the past? Bring the viewers over here. You gotta talk louder. Okay. <laughs> What's the, what are we looking at? Um, well, I was gonna show people that, where are they? The Pelicans? Gun case. Yeah, but you can get these ones that are really good for knife cases. Yes, they can be knife cases. We've done that before. Uh, what brand have we used the most it's of? Apache. This is the brand? Yeah. Yeah. So you can get these. I'm trying and to think what collection of knives we could fit in there. Well, maybe Protec? We could fit all of our Protex in there. What do you think? Yeah, no. She doesn't like foam. Ugh, hate it. Oh, this one doesn't. Oh yeah, it does have the cutouts. So it has perforated um, squares, so you can make um, knife holders in them. Knife holders. Oh, and then what did I, what did I read? Because these are like the um, these are the cheap options of Pelican cases. But then you can buy because these have gotten so popular, you can buy the good Pelican knife inserts for these. Okay. So then you make a really good knife container. I thought Pelican was a brand. It is. Well, you're saying Pelican. Yeah, these are a cheap Pelican. Okay, because they're Apaches. Yeah. You're going to confuse people though. Yeah, I'm going to confuse people, but you can then buy the good brand inserts or knives. Okay. For these cheap containers. Those are standard sizes. Yeah. Actually, uh -huh. the size wouldn't even matter. You just cut it to whatever, yeah. right? Yeah. It makes it really nice. But look, you can have, there's all different colors now. I like the green. We have two of these black ones at home. It's definitely been a while since we've been in here. Yeah. This is the last one that we filmed at, too. Uh-huh. We should go back and watch that video. Oh, ammo look. Cases. That's the traditional style ammo can. I remember those from surplus stores. Yeah, for 50 cal. Yep. Can I figure out how to open it? There's more knives. Yeah. Okay. Knives? Barely. Yeah, no. It's the button lock ones. I wish it was a Where were we that they had knives in two different um, parts of the store? They weren't that far away from each other, but they had them definitely in, in different aisles. I don't know. Might have been Lowe's. Oh, that could be. They kind of put them all over the place. Like they had a more of a carpenter style selection and then more of an EDC style. I don't know. Okay. What Do you like shop towels? Yes or shop no? Shop towels? No. I love shop towels. What do I'm you mean? I'm surprised you like the feel. No. Because you don't like the feel of foam. I don't like the feel of those. Oh, okay. I don't like the feel of microfiber though. Microfiber? Yeah, I don't yeah. like the microfiber. 
All right. Well, there's not well, much here. Is there anything else we should look at for this video? Ooh, we could show people that this is an option too. We could show them what's an option. A nice organizer for knives. Any of these work really nicely too. I like the color. Yeah. I bet you'd get tired of it though. But look at how nice, wouldn't that be neat to just lay them all out in there? Yeah. As long as you don't jolt the doors open. If, if you're laying them out, you'd want to be careful. We're loving the music right now. It's December, oh, it's December 8th or 9th. Mm -hmm. Ooh, I do love their mini tools. I love these. And they do have these around the house. It's Frankie's size. Yeah, I like them. I like these because it's more my size. Yeah, you have a bent nose too. It's, a rep it's representative. It has long reach, so you can get up in there. Uh, yeah. Yeah. Yep. Mm -hmm. This one has a curve. <laughs> they have a pill for that. <laughs> <laughs> that is true, they do. Peroni <laughs> syndrome? <laughs> I thought it was a disease. I don't know. I think it's Peroni's disease. It's... Look at this. I like how this one's marked down. I wonder why. And it's, it's marked down for more than it's on sale for so i'm very confused by this it, it needs to be like less than half the price it's missing more than half the tools <laughs> it is funny. oh i like these why do i like wrenches so much i like baby that's ones too. that's a set of c-clamps Hey, where's the sequence? Right here. There? That's yeah, that's monstrous. Yeah. Alright, no, we're not uh, we're not showing knives though. Okay. No, we're not. We're just showing tools. Tool cases. Now we're talking our collection. Yeah, it's getting better. This thing. It's getting closer. With the end tables. I could sleep up there. Yeah, you could. I wonder if the cats would like hanging out in this. Probably. wrap it up okay okay that's cool somebody's gonna say we missed like the knife cases no it's not really knife cases as well so without watching our video from five years ago how is the selection the same it's garden mm -hmm. but now they've switched to gordon Back to the car. Okay. People have used these for knife storage too. These little wooden ones. Those little individual slots. Yeah, they're they'd be nice. They'd be good. Yeah. Or for jewelry or watches. That is a nice little case. You could check if you have salad in your teeth before you go on video. She was bugging me. She said, I can't take you seriously with that, with that lettuce in your teeth. That is true. It's hard to take you serious. We anyway, back to the car. Okay, fine. All right, what'd you think? It was amazing. It was, she's being sarcastic. There are so many things to choose from. Yeah. Benchmade, Spyderco, Microtex, like so many that you would not have thought were in Harbor Freight. I actually don't even want to disclose how much money we just spent. <laughs> yeah, we did. Um, it was under $2,000. That was pretty impressive. No. For one knife. You guys, yeah, right. You guys <laughs> saw it. It wasn't, uh, do you, does your Harbor Freight have more? 
or I, less. Um, I, yeah. I don't know. How? Yeah. But anyways. I guess we shouldn't expect too much because it really is all kind of their brands. Yeah, it's always so, it's always been like the crappy stuff. Like That's Harbor Freight though. Yeah, it is. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So I was surprised to see button locks though. Lots of button locks. Which is weird. That would not have been the same five years ago. Mm -mm. No. They've really taken off. Yeah. In the last few years. Yeah. Maybe they'll bring in Macarta and Ultim here soon. Ultim? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Well, they're going to have Magna Cut. Oh, probably. But yeah, it was another two weeks. Yeah. yeah. No, it right. was a wait. If, uh, <laughs> if you made it this far, give us a thumbs up. Make sure to subscribe, all that mm -hmm. stuff. All right. Yep. Thanks a lot for joining us. Bye.